it is Crystal with Pineapple Papers, and it is June 12th of 30 Days of Sketches with Christie's Beautiful Life. So today, uh, the exclusive sketch is from Miss Carrie, from Miss Carrie Creations, and it is beautiful. I love all the strips of paper. It is a perfect sketch for like Mad About Mini Paper Pads, um, which isn't today, but <clears throat> great way to use up mini paper pads or even scraps. So I am using a paper pad. I am using the Mittens and Mistletoe from Crate Paper. And I just went through and pulled pieces that were scraps. So um, none of them were full eight, six by eight papers. So they were all, they were all scraps. And I cut them basically in the length that, that I had. So you can see like this piece that I'm using right now is not quite tall enough. So I'm going to go ahead and rip that in half. I'm also going to use some of the branding strips from these papers as well. And um, <clears throat> I will just make sure that my photo will cover up the gaps. So this is my photo. It is from 2021 from Christmas. This would have been um, Christmas Eve mass. And we actually got a family photo, which is like crazy impressive. So I'm going to take, this is the full six by eight paper that I pulled from the pad and it's a great wood green. There's so much um, wood in the church. I figured that that was appropriate. Plus it was a completely different color than anything that I had going in the background. So it is going to stand out. So I'm going to make that one large tag and I just fold the tips over. I learned this from um, Jackie from JQ Crafting. If you just fold it over and cut <clears throat> the corner off, you'll actually get a perfectly even a tag. So love how that works. Did also go ahead and added a, a hole with my little hole punch. Uh, there's not a... Uh, there's not a precise, I just guessed. <laughs> like it's, it's close. So I've got that. And then I'm going to take a couple of extra papers, extra scraps that I have sitting over here. And I'm going to do that bottom portion of the sketch where you can see some more strips of paper. I have this little corner cut off and I was thinking that maybe I wanted to put it somewhere. Ultimately, I I don't. I just, <clears throat> I think it goes in the bin. So I have all of my papers down and now I'm going to pull out my embellishments, basically all of my Christmas type embellishments. So I have these Vicki Booten puffy words and I don't want to bring in any black. I don't have any black on this layout. Uh, just the brown and uh, Christmas colors. So I am going to settle on gold for my title. And it says believe together. And when I put that gold down, I remembered I had this gold washi tape on my desk that I wanted to use as some of the strips but I had kind of forgot about it and everything is glued down. So I'm just going to trim a couple of pieces and then just hide it underneath the tag. So it's not going to go completely from top to bottom. It's going to, I'm really going to, I guess, uh, be stingy with it, even though I'm trying to use it up. No, I just don't want to pull everything up. So I'm going to add two strips to the top and then I'm also going to add a strip down there to the bottom cluster that I have started. So it brings that gold around a little bit more, which is perfect since the title is gold. 
Um, this is not very sticky. So off screen, I will add some liquid glue to it. <clears throat> it sticks okay for, you know, the short amount of time when you're making your layout, but there's definitely no longevity to it. Now she has that circular element up there <clears throat> in the top and I wanted to add that as well, but the circular element that I had was black. And like I said, I didn't want to bring any black in. So instead, I am going to just add some die cuts. I'm going to add a journaling spot down there at the bottom, um, which will probably just have, you know, midnight mass and the year. <clears throat> it's probably not going to say anything exciting, um, but I am going to get a little something on there. And then I like the little house. Um, obviously we're in a church, but that is the house of God. So I figure houses totally work for church. Of course, any building, <clears throat> I figure if, if you're inside a building, you can put a house on it. So many of the collections come with houses that you just got to find places and reasons to use it. And so that is going to be my rationale for that. Now I do have some of these fake brads and I am going to get four of them on. So to cover my tag hole, which I'm not sure that I like, um, it says 25, which is, which is perfect, but there's quite a bit of blank space there to the right. And I almost wonder if it would look better if I added some twine and then I can take that brad and move it somewhere else. So I add a brad to the bottom cluster as well as two brads over to right next to the title. Then I'm going to go through the uh, sticker sheet or the sticker book for mittens and mistletoe. And I'm going to add a few things. Um, I swapped out the floral on the bottom by the title, added some little holly to the bottom cluster, and then uh, a floral. I'm also going to add a tiny word sticker to that bottom cluster that says Christmas. Not that that uh, isn't obvious with, but that's okay. So there is my layout. I hope you enjoyed this. Make sure that you go give some love to Miss Carrie uh, for this sketch and check out the playlist down below. So remember to wear your crown and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.